Hello, my lovelies. We're talking energy again. So this is what I'm seeing a lot of, and this is what we must be paying attention to if we can for the next little while. Take a look at what is making you stay stuck. What keeps coming back time and time again? What is the pattern that is capturing your attention and pushing you into that space where you feel like you're just doing the same pattern or the same thing again, or it's coming towards you again and you think, oh, surely I'm done with that by now. What is keeping you stuck? And just for a little while, look at the thing or the episode or the people or the circumstance. Look at that that's making you stuck. And then go another step down and say, okay, if that is what's showing in the field around me in my circumstance or in the interactions or the thing that's around me, if that's what's showing me where I'm stuck, then I must take responsibility for me being stuck. What is making me not be able to move and shift through this and change the frequency, change the energy, change the story what is getting me into this place of being stuck and how can I be with me and help me in a way to really help me to not get stuck not get stuck in these places that just start to overwhelm me and sort of just drown me a little bit how can I do this so start to look at what it is in me be willing to ask that question and it's so much easier for us to say, oh, no, it's because of that, because of this, and point the finger towards any and everything else and say it's because of that that I'm in this space and it's because of them that I feel this way. My treasure, you're giving away too much of your power. No one can make you anything. The way we react, the way we respond, and the way we are integrating, connecting our energy with others is so that we can become more clear about what it is that we want and don't want. So when it reflects to us, it doesn't make it a thing that says, okay, so that's the only way I can be because that's what's showing itself to me. It is possible that that is showing to you so that you will make another choice or so that you will witness that as contrast and awaken that place in your heart that says, I'm longing and calling for something different. Look at where you are and notice if you have resistance, if you're doing defending, deflecting, denying, distracting, detaching, if you're doing any of those DDD words, you're in the wrong place. You are pushing it away instead of welcoming it in. So now, this week, go like this and just say, oh, okay, I'm in that place. It feels a little bit sticky, icky, bluish, stuckness. What is it? And who am I in it? And how do I feel and how do I think and how do I process about where I am? Just start to look at yourself. Don't try and fix it. Just observe, notice, and very, very soon you will find the pathway through it. It is like shining a light in a dark space. We just have to light one little match in a very dark room, wait a moment, and our eyes adjust, and then we can see pretty much everything in that space from one tiny little flash of light. It's just like that. That tiny flash of light is our tiny flash of insight. And the insight is in sight. I'm willing to look at me. All right, my sweet peas. So much love to you. Have a very fabulous week. Namaste.